Okay. Let's get Kurt in here. Oh. Uh, okay. Invite to remote to play. Please. Please. I just want to play. We did try some other options, by the way, and um, yeah, it didn't work. So remote play, it has to be. Furry. Welcome, welcome. Nope. Nope, it didn't work? Nope. Come on. This is one of the dumbest. I believe. I believe. I believe. The, fir the first step is actually getting Kurt in here. There we go. Ha! Alright, you got two yellow bars. That's pretty good, considering. That's not bad. <laughs> Alright, let's do this! Okay, so, it looks like we're currently, um, currently beached up. Are you working? Alright, current mobile. That's a good sign. I can just turn over the controls really quick. That's part right here. Oh. Call you up. Don't <laughs> Wait for it. <laughs> <laughs> I love the face. <laughs> Cast is like, why do I do this to myself? Right. Where are you going, Summer? Oh, why are you sad? Maybe because she was hungry? Now she's, she's happy. Give her a hug. I will come. You don't want to hug her? Oh, yeah, it's, not, it's not as cute as when I hug her. Mm. Aww. Mm. Now her mood's a lot better. I didn't remember that she liked the shirt. She likes dessert. Mm -hmm. Same here. Mm. What do you hey, mean, Stella? I'm not the one giving it to you. Oh my god, you. I was just like, who's controlling my <laughs> menu? <laughs> that was a different menu. <laughs> Freaked me out. <laughs> Double menu all the way across the sky. Okay, give hugs to everybody. Let's see if uh, Gwen will want a hug today. Gwenma? Oh yeah, Gwenma. My bad. Mm. Mm. Oh, I just realized she was talking to me. <laughs> I was like, I, <laughs> let me hug you. <laughs> Sharon, the Everdor. Oh, thank you for the resub, oh, Matifer. Matted fur resub for 11 Yay, months. Yay, 11 months. How time flies, or so they say. Coming up on your one year. Can, I, can everyone else hear Rocket be talking? <laughs> he was just talking about you just now. <laughs> Sharon, the Everdor, the Spirit Fairs. This place, this boat, to me being here. Hold on, I need to. I need to turn off Rocket Me for a second so you're not talking in my ear the whole time. There you go. You must be wondering what is going on. Truth be told, I don't really know either. But I'm here for you. I'll do my best to help you and try to make sense of it all. As I said earlier, I wanted to leave by myself, but somehow I just couldn't. Now that I see you, I think I know why. Sounds like they're in the closet trying to speak to everyone. <laughs> yeah, they were just very muffled. I, I might have just gagged them and threw them into the closet. <laughs> I'll give you some space for now. Don't hesitate to explore this ship. Mm -hmm. You can even give that fishing rod a try. The world is your oyster. VIP press went up. This is a conspiracy to keep me from obtaining it. Did it? It's always been five fives. Ah! 
Ah! Oh, right, right. I'm sorry. <laughs> she, she, yes, give me the thread. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. There we go. There we go. Feeling much better. I like when you walk through the door. <laughs> Do you just call me human? Where are we going right now? Um, there's some new places we can go to. Yes, there's a question go? mark. There's a, there's there's the villa that Gwen wants us to go to. Um, I think we're also trying to build stuff, weren't we? We're trying to build something. Let me check pointless again. I think we're upgrading places. So we need oak, planks, limestone. All right, so we got to go to islands and the dragon. No, no, it's five fives because I, five is my favorite number. And um, I think I also wanted to, yeah, we needed to make a, we wanted to make other stuff too. The oh. foundry and the sawmill. We can make the, make the sawmill actually now. Yeah, let's make sawmill, yeah. All right, let's position you smartly. We need to move stuff later. Cause I think that can fit on. Can I move? Yeah, edit. You go up here for a second. Um, move the um. Move the... I was gonna say, I usually put the kitchen underneath the sawmill because it fits super well. Oh, okay. Let me do that. Or, yeah. Yep. Like that? I think it's the... yeah. And then... here. Allow me. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. That's all right. There you go. I think you right, need to. Uh, yeah. Come on. You're learning how to use DaVinci Resolve. I recommend it. It's, it's pretty good. Very versatile for being free. Thank you for the one bit cheer, furry. learning you definitely don't do that <laughs> great great answer mad at for hey Kurt, did you learn anything new this week hmm. did i learn anything this week um, did you you learn where the wps button on your router was that's true i learned that uh if you're gonna buy a printer don't because it's <laughs> a pain in the butt <laughs> Well, if you buy a printer and it's going to be wireless, buy one with a screen. Seriously. Because then you can just enter the password. That's <laughs> yeah, a little... Uh, wow, works. nice shiny new badge. Okay, can't do anything there. Printers are designed to fail and be difficult, I swear. True! I I definitely feel the same way. Alright. Wireless setup is just annoying in general. Yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Man, I had some lunch. I just had some bagel bites and I'm not. I'm still hungry. Want more Curse bagel bites? The, the ever hungry void. Yes. Oh, my controller. There we go. I just had to stretch. Oh yeah, we didn't pick a destination. Oh. We just said we needed, um... We needed oak, limestone, is what we said. So there's limestone here. Oops, I forgot how to do multiple things with it. Get me in. So 
So there's limestone there. Um, there's a rare chest. There's some rare chests there, but we can just go back. Whatever. Um, let's see. What's this? There's maple. Is there any other oak? It's just wood. How about we just go like boink, 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 eventually making our way to this place for Gwen. All right, that worked. Do we need more seeds, or are we good on seeds? Now go on something. Hi, hey, Snacko. This looks amazing. Thank you for helping me out, Stella. This sawmill is so big. What a beauty. There's just one problem. Now don't get mad. I don't have any money to repay you. I guess that's why they call it a favor. I guess I'm gonna have to wear a maid outfit and make you food from now on. <laughs> oh no, I forgot my money. You see what I did there? Thanks again, Sprout. Fun note, printer ink is one of the most expensive liquids, but only when found in consumer printers. My, my dad actually, um, I had a printer that I primarily used throughout high school because I had different classes that wanted you to print out your assignments. And I always gave you like super long multi-page assignments. Um, and my dad actually found like this cheap printer ink alternative to buying the brand ink. And the printer- uh, excuse me. Huh? What? Oh. Stop at the island. Oh, I guess it didn't register when I put it there. How much does that curtain your arms? I want to buy them from you. Okay, what do you think? We can split. <laughs> Being kidnapped. You already were kidnapped. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I was kidnapped. Listen, once you're in their arms, you can do whatever you want. You can escape. <laughs> you cannot escape. I forgot what song we came up for, for this one. Uh, let it go? Was it let it go? No. Was it let it go? I don't think it was let it go. I think let it go so. didn't work very well. Was it a sea shanty? Oh. Ah. oh, he hung you again. Here, have berries. <laughs> He's like, thank you. <laughs> yeah, now, always they try to include a chip inside the printer ink cartridges to try and lock people into using only theirs. Yeah, I didn't notice that, because for a while it did work for me. And then, like, every so often it'll be like, sorry, this printer ink is not compatible. But usually if I just... Mine is old enough that if I, like, just freaking um, keep shoving it in there... Then eventually it's like, okay, fine. The, this printer ink is, is acceptable. Are you good, Kurt? Working on it. That's part of the reason I haven't bought a new printer yet, because I'm like, I, I know if I get a printer, it's gonna be, it's gonna have a requirement. Goodbye, Kurt. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even need to use a printer right now. I just used the printer at the uh, at the school since I work there. It is ten cents per page, but you know what? That's still cheaper than printing. Oh, that reminds me, I need to buy a new parking pass for the next semester. You got a surprise? Oh. I was hungry as usual, so I did something about it. I went outside the boat and gathered some berries, oh. but I went a little overboard. I have too much. Here you go. Have a wonderful day. Thank you. 
Oh. Okay, now they got ink that you fill a tank in the printer. I wonder what's up with that. A tank? I, I have seen that, yeah. Do you, like, you pour the ink in or something? Well, does that mean that... Yeah. Hmm. Well, then, can you just get any ink now? That was very hard when I had my thumb cast on. He used to go to the snacko. He, the snacko's got a snack. For a second, I thought the cat was pooping something. <laughs> Kurt, how could you? In the sawmill of all do places. Anything. In the sawmill of all places. Did you know you can catch different fish when it rains? Maybe they like to come up to drink the fresh water that's dripping down. Pretty neat, right? Oh, it's a good time to fish then. Let's see how Kurt does. Oh, it's time. Time to see the latency. Oh. Nice. Not a fish. Nah, so close. That was a hard fish. It just constantly was. I know, I saw it. It was like time, red whammy. most of the time. It's time. Let's it's do time this. To test it. Time to yep. really test it. Yep. Sprout a storm. Let's try and catch some lightning. Remember, your Everlight will protect you. What'd you say? That's the spirit. Just stand below each hit. Alright. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Is there any up there? Down. No. Ah. Ugh. Oh, that, that one took a while. Damn it. Oh, these ones up here are hard to get to. Oh, I forgot I have double jumping. <laughs> no, no, stay up there so we can see the whole thing. Okay. If you can get back up. <laughs> I can get back up. Oh, nice catch. Actually, that was really good. I didn't lag at all. Knock yeah, on wood, knock on nice. Knock on wood. Back on wood, yeah. <laughs> the heat hasn't gone up yet. <laughs> Oops. Stop saying your door. You did great. You're ready to start cutting wood like a champ. Just remember to be careful with this sawmill. Don't go and mess around with dangerous saw blades. Just because you got left of wood doesn't mean to cut your hand off. Thank you. Oh. You've been chopping it up in the sawmill. I like it. Getting the work done. Learn a new skill. Now that you got some materials, maybe you could build me a house. Let me sketch something real quick. Look, it's nothing fancy. It's pretty basic, which is a few things here and there. And a few nails there and there. Oh, you already got some materials to build me something nice. I'm asking not only for me, but for the crew. Apparently, I snore at night. Loudly, according to your friend Gwen. <laughs> we should get, make the ship bigger. <laughs> nope. Yep. Never mind. Yep. 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 Yep.
I was trying to do you a favor, let you let you finish. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, we need maple planks. Oh, I don't know where I am. Um, did you? I think you fell in the water. Yeah, there you are. Um, are you invisible? Sure. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Sure, game. Some barnacles. I'm drowning. That sucks. What was the other thing we wanted to build? The foundry. Foundry. Oh, we need plate. oak. Okay. Okay. Ah, now you're invisible. Yeah, oh, you, you, you just sent me to the bottom of the ocean. Do it all the time. I As you know, I tend else. to get hungry. That's just a fact of life. Sometimes when I do, I get hungry for really specific things. Like a shrimp cocktail, maybe. Oh. Your Aunt Bib would call this a laugh of the tummy. Don't get me wrong. You still eat pretty much whatever's in front of me. I'd just like for you to put some effort into this one. I'll give you a shout when I get a craving. Hopefully I won't ask for anything too extreme. You never know with this appetite. Fair warning, Sprout. All right, fair yeah, enough. Your last craving took me all game to figure out where to get the ingredients. <laughs> what was it? It was, uh... Heard Wham's how it's going, it's Snacko! Hi, Snacko! Yay! Snacko! Snacko, we are doing so- Oh, sorry. We're doing sorry. so good. In the art lock. How are you doing, Snacko? Did you see your final Eva, by the way, Kurt? I did not. I, um... I had work that Friday, and then I had to go to the dinner. So I, ah. I didn't even get to see you guys. Uh, I'll make sure it's still on Twitter. Okay. Oh, that's Twitter. We love you too, Snacko. We actually gave you a character in the game. <laughs> yeah, you have a character in the game. I'm trying to figure out how to put some mic grip to a desk with no ledges. Ah, that does seem difficult. <laughs> that does seem like a challenge. <laughs> Time to attach it to your ceiling. No, I'm kidding. Oh. Nine more to go. For what? The blanks. See, it says eight. Oh, okay. Tells you how many are left. Where's the sparklies? I can't see them. <laughs> Probably because I'm in the sawmills. Ah! Where's Burgundy? Oh, I just speared. Uh oh. No, what kind of microphone do you have? Just your headset? Oh, that was a good one. That was 100% success right there. Damn, I, sh I shouldn't have pointed out. <laughs> okay, now now you're free. No sparklies. No sparklies. What? I got juked. You got juked. You know what? Just oh, because. Yeah. Come here, come here. We need to show Snacko Snacko. Oh. Look at Snacko. It's Snacko. <laughs> a big, Snacko right big here. hug friend. Wait, can I get yes. a hug right now? Yay! No. Oh, did you? What? Oh, you just ate. <laughs> Wasn't that great, favorite niece of mine? He's he's hungry again, Kurt. Hungry again. Right. Always hungry. <laughs> this is Edma. Gwenma. Gwenma. Definitely a shark. But his interest in all things maritime will be helpful, mm -hmm. such as the boat upgrades he sells at outrageously high prices. Uh, actually, yeah, we should see the shark too, since no one's here. <laughs> with those, you'll oh, be yeah. able to cross the ominous weather barriers of the world. They look like classic mythical challenges again. A bit cliche, if you ask me. We don't know who the snake is. The snake is just snake right now. Yeah, that's just summer. Come on. 
Ah. Uh, <laughs> you can't look at the map. It's too dark. Bill. I know. Hold on. Put Albert Shipyard on the map. Yep. Why not? Because it's more chance. How many how many maple things did I make? Hey, you make it. Yeah. Oh my god, yeah, we definitely need so big. <laughs> we definitely need an upgrade. Snack yep. lives in a luxurious apartment. <laughs> You know me. No I could always go for a little snack. Something salty. Ooh. Something buttery. Something with flavor. Oh, jeez. You know what would be just perfect? A popcorn. big old bag of popcorn all to myself. Yeah. Just go ahead and eat up some corn. Here you go. I got just the thing. Ooh. Hmm. That really did fill me up. However, it did make me miss my kids a whole lot. Snack has kids? Ooh. I wow, used to make up. bags of popcorn on movie night for them. Even with the TV turned up, you couldn't hear the actors talking. The crunching was so loud. Ooh. It wasn't the only way to calm those little... It was the only way to calm those little monsters down. Watching these terrible kids movies. Oh. I wish I was still there. Ooh. To see them laughing. For them to oh. fall asleep on me. Thank you for this popcorn. Ooh. I was looking at your kitchen yesterday. It's fine. Nothing special. Ooh. It reminds me of my first kitchen. In my terrible apartment. I didn't know what I was doing in there. I was so careless with the spices. Not enough salt. Anyways, here's a little something to brighten this mess up. Don't worry, it's not a spice rack. You'll need to actually work for it, but it'll be worth it. Just improve your kitchen with some extra oven space. Your kitchen will be looking just right in no time. Nice. Yeah, let's see. Ugh. Okay, catch. We need linen, linen fabric. Well, I did just grow some. And It's so perfect, Sprout. It's massive. All this room for little old me? I can't wait to catch some shut eye. This is really great. Thank you so much. I won't forget this. Oh, look how nice this is for you. Oh, he's already working on it. <laughs> he's like, I'll just tune it up just a little bit. Oh, sorry, I thought I was starting to snakey. Sorry, Stella, you know how much I despise fruits. Um, my bad, I meant to give you something else. Mm, I see. gave her coffee last, so probably popcorn. Okay. I'll take comfort food over almost anything. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. <laughs> what are we all do? Oh my god! <laughs> Zaka, please! <laughs> Trying to hug Glenma. <laughs> Oh, oh, looks like we're at the shipyard. Okay. Now we can see Nova. <laughs> yeah, let's go talk to Nova. Let's go, let's go talk to Nova and hear some terrible jokes. Yep. Nova, are you here? Ready to meet your character? Nova, come in here. You need a voice act to scare her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. That's a nice garden. That's true, we need Snacko in here too. That's a nice garden. And Enma. Knock, knock. Oh. Who's there? Lettuce. Lettuce. Who? Let us in and you'll find out! <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> I'm dead on the ground. Uh, okay, we need oak plants and linen threads for that, but 
We have enough. Oh, have no. Damn it. We don't even have enough for our mailbox. <laughs> All right. Well, we get. We wait. Hold on. I see why they are Nova. Everyone else. But Welcome yeah. back to the shipyard, Stella. Tell me, what do you need? Nothing. Stop playing your stuff like that. <laughs> I know. I hate when he does that. You know, we could get the mailbox right now. We just need to make more. Let's go do that. <laughs> you want to make Lennon? Uh, with my lag? Sure. Yeah, let's see this. No problem, furry. Have a good BRB. Oops. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. How dare you! <laughs> How dare you! <laughs> How dare you? I'm sorry, I had a Skype pop up, or not a Skype, a Steam pop up, and I was trying to close it, I forgot. How dare you? <laughs> did you? Did you get enough? Uh, I think so. Okay. <laughs> My bad. I actually don't know. I, I was so, I was so uh -huh. distracted. Let's check, let's check our inventory. Where is it? Oh, yeah, we do. Okay. I just slid right forward. I did it look good. I was just like, wow. And then you just, just stole that from me. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I'm sitting right here. <laughs> good luck with that. I'm gonna force you over. Now we got a letter. From Albert. God, we have so many menu tabs. There it is. Stella, make sure you change your address permanently. You'll have more letters coming shortly. Make sure you're keeping up with your writing. Pen pals are the best pals. Everyone knows that. Ruff, 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 ruff. Nice. All right, uh, onward. Upward and upward. I say... We go here. I agree. We go here. Oh, hold on. No, I'm just texting me. Yeah. We go here. There we go. My mom, my mom's crazy. <laughs> look at, look at. Ah, oh, they're all hand, having some when work mom. done. Ta-da! You know, I'm delighted that you're here with me. But I'm not surprised one bit. It adds up. You're here taking care of me in my final hours. You're always cared so much about... Da you, da <laughs> <laughs> you always cared so much... Da da You've always cared so damn much about others. Ooh. Always protected those you found vulnerable. Even penda pedantic snobs like me. Damn it. Remember the day my father yelled at my cat? Mm -hmm. We just got out of elementary school. You were wearing those blue sneakers with the glittery tags. And there you were yelling back at my father like you were on a mission. Mm -hmm. Father turned red and smashed the purple Delano vase. It was rad. You know, guys, this week we had a very epic D and D session. Yeah, me constantly just trying to uh, fix the freaking printer. <laughs> that wasn't even the whole session. You 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 had dinner first, and then you had uh, had to fix the printer. I missed like I missed like half the D and D session just 
Well, uh, should, I, should I read? Should I tell you what happened since you missed me? Ah, uh, there was a TV. There she goes. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. All right, so let me let me give some context here. So let's kind of let's just start with what happened in the previous session a little bit, because I think it was the beginning of that one as well. Which I mean, it's fine. Like we that we knew that was happening with scheduling that you would probably miss like the beginning for dinner and stuff. This is not this is not an attack on Kurt. <laughs> I feel I feel it. Yeah, I feel it. We still, still got to see how the next semester is going to work out uh, since JT schedule is going to be changing. Yeah, and with me because I might be getting. That's because true. Of my new job. Your new but job is going to change your hours to be more flexible, I think. Uh, for the most part, it's going to be from like either 12 to 7 or 2 to 7. Those mm. were the schedules that were open. I don't know what day. She didn't give me a day. Okay. So. Yeah. Well, I guess we'll, we'll see, because we got to figure yeah. stuff out when next semester hits anyway. Um, so yeah, I'm sure Terrence actually might know what his schedule is by now, so we can plan that later. I'm coming to water you, and then you get watered by the rain, so you maybe come all the way up here. I didn't appreciate any of this. <laughs> so, to You're preface... You water in the rain. I, I didn't mean, I meant to exit. To preface, um, the story is that they are on a quest to rob or to you know just just to hassle some dragons that own a casino and currently they decided that they want to recruit some some allies some dragon allies that are like in natural competition with these other dragons so they're doing a quest for one of these potential allies to get her on their side and also because they owe her a favor anyway and it involves going all the way south of the continent to Deal with the dragon that she doesn't like and steal her house, basically. Because she needs a new house, she's having new babies, and she needs a new house. That's the premise. So they started their journey, and um, on this like first leg of their journey, oh, it's a dragon, isn't it? <laughs> no, but like everyone has like a. Okay, yeah. Oh, oh, God, this be... oh that's what I was doing. The dragon is back, Stella. Should we help it? All right, let's get ready for it. All right, now, now you guys get to see how absolutely bad I am at this. Yeah, all right, let's do this. I'll let you do all the work. Oh, that was good. No, it's not that part. Nothing, I guess. <laughs> Whee! It was a oh. boat. <laughs> Hello, Gwen. Just cleaning up. Be happy. It looks relieved, doesn't it? Ooh. I wonder what it means. If we are ever to cross this dragon's path again, I think we should help it. How Rai might feel about it. For now, though, I need some time to collect my thoughts. Thank you, Stella, for everything. Speaking of dragons. <laughs> Speaking of dragons, yeah. Mail. Dang. Protest flyer, raccoon ink flyer. 
Workers unite. You're done being paid unfair wages. You're done being exploited for benefits to the upper class. Say no to capitalist abuse. Rally to our cause at Bottom Line Corps. Union for working you denizens. <laughs> You're a flyer. <laughs> Raccoon Ink Flyer. Dear customer, due to unforeseen supply shortage of our Bottom Line Corps depot, Raccoon Ink will no longer be able to apply our special rebate program to, for reoccurring customers. Please know it is with great regret that we have to inform you of this situation. And rest assured, value customer, our continuous efforts of, of our continuous efforts to improve it. Raccoon Ink Trade is our family name. Dang. Nako, the only reason why you're not the raccoon in this game is because he's a sleazy little brat. <laughs> a sleazy capitalist. <laughs> yeah. So I was just like, no, we're not we're not gonna make Snacko Steezy, we're gonna make him cute and huggable and lovable and he loves and he loves food. Upgrade our kitchen for us. <laughs> Maybe I'm evil after all. Uh oh. <laughs> so uh, back to D and D. What if the snacko you know is all a lie? I'm gonna tell Rock and me if that's the case. The ro Rock and me, the snacko you fell in love with. I mean, uh, crush. I mean, um, don't tolerate. <laughs> Hi, Kurt. <laughs> Having a good moment there. Hi. Wanna rock and roll all night <laughs> and party every day. Where are we going? Nowhere. No, nowhere anywhere? I know Oops. her. Whoops. You do know her. <laughs> but do you? Hmm. <gasps> mm. I know the real her. You got this. I believe in you. There you go. You did it. I did it. JK, I'm just super boring and take care of plants. <laughs> oh, maybe we should make the snack. Oh, your summer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So, oh, I'm going to be inside. So, I rolled some random encounters for their trip, and their random encounter was running into a night hag in disguise that tricked them into taking a basket with a changeling baby in it. Which, uh, which Ranch is still very sore about. <laughs> very mad about. Very mad about getting this this baby for 20 gold pieces. <laughs> a storm! Let's try and catch some lightning. Okay. Yes. I can definitely talk and also lightning catch at the same time. Absolutely not, you cannot. Yes, I can. Let's split. Oh, yeah. You be up there, I'll be down here. So... The one thing about this witch that was important is that she has an ability to enter the ethereal plane at will. So she was going to be a very tricky fight. They did find her. She revealed herself just to attack the party once because um, she was like, I'm just going to slap them really hard and then go back and hide again and they can't do anything about it. So that's where Ascension ended last time. And then we sorry. started. Oh, you're, oh, you're, you're good. You're good. <laughs> We started in the middle of combat with the witch. Oop, damn it. Said my bad. And my whole plan for the combat was like, if they don't kill her in like the one round that they get, then she's gonna just go back into hiding and then taunt them. So it was basically like, you guys better freaking slap her with everything you got. And it was a little harder because I forgot Kurt wouldn't be there. So I was like, okay, I'll give them like an extended period. I gave them two rounds to kill her. Um, she did escape. She escaped into the ethereal plane. So I was like, well, I guess, um, I guess they just gotta figure out a creative solution here. And I was actually talking about it with Itamar, like, uh, on Wednesday night. I was like, yeah, I d I'm curious what solutions they'll try to come up with to deal with her. If it comes to that. And we were going back and forth because neither of us could think of, like, a spell or a way to, like, deal with it that you guys had currently. So I was like, I wonder if they're just going to have this witch following you guys for a while. Just kind of taunting you. 
hug. But I forgot Ooh. that uh, the Terrans had a spell, and it's called, um, what was it? Banishment. I think Terrans talked about using a spell a few times before, I completely forgot about it. I didn't think it would work either because I thought that you'd need to be like in the same plane of existence. Like you'd have to be able to like physically, physically like touch them. But here's, but here's the thing about the spell and I read it very carefully. It only said you have to see them. It only said you had to see them. And Terrence could, because of his wizard ability, could see the witch in the eth ethereal plane. So Terrence was just like, can I just banish her back here? I was like, yeah, technically you can banish her out of, <laughs> banish her back to you guys. That's true. But then Terrence was like, wait, no, I have a better idea. What if I banish three of us to her? <laughs> and then we just kill her there. So that's that's what you missed. Was, I'm um... so sad I missed that. Because <laughs> I, I heard it because you guys told me about that. And I was just like, I missed that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it was pretty Literally, epic. <laughs> I was not holding... I was not... I was... I missed nope. that so... I was so sad. Alright. To be fair, Terrence would have only been able to do three people anyway. <laughs> so it kind of worked out. But it, I, I like, am sad that he did how, how, like, what pity revenge was it that literally they're just, the witch was just like, haha, I can't catch me. And then, boom. <laughs> and they did not hold back. Like, I thought maybe it'd take a couple rounds, and then she'd have to decide, like, do I stay here? Do I go back to the other plane? I'm kind of... There's still people there. There was, like, all the pets surrounding her and Ashton and everything, and technically you. <laughs> but no, they, they... Terrence, like, slapped her with an ethereal fireball and ended her life. <laughs> that is here so we funny. are. Yeah. <laughs> it was great. So that's why Terrence got inspiration, even though Terrence already had inspiration. You guys need to use your inspiration. <laughs> you keep telling us, but we keep forgetting. Like, I'm trying to think, like, when when could I have used mine? And I'm just like, like, yeah, maybe if I would like, oh, do an do a investigation and I roll a zero, I'm just like, oh, well, you know, I it mean, makes it more funnier. I mean, it's, it's always something, like, you should always save it for something that you, like, you could, you really need it for. But I mean, yeah, you I'm guys, it for, like, you save I... it so hard, you just don't use it. <laughs> it's kind of like, one of those, so like, I'm saving it for, have. like, one of my death rolls, you know? Yeah, but like, if you can get it again, you can get another inspiration. <laughs> Clearly, we can get another inspiration. Honestly, I didn't know how they worked, so I was just like, oh, one time thing, better hold on to it. Just like that freaking I almost Ooh. turned the stupid thing into a freaking... I, I admit, Yara. Um, some people are very stingy with giving out inspiration. Um, but you guys, I mean, you guys are pretty creative. <laughs> there hasn't really been too many instances where you guys haven't surprised me. <laughs> the, which again, that's why I was talking to Inamar about this. I don't like plan for you guys to do specific things, except in very certain circumstances where I know you guys well enough to predict how you'll react to something. Like, um, I was telling Inamar, I, I kind of knew how Hector would take the lady with the hot lady with the basket. I knew that he would pay for the whole thing and take the whole basket. So I purposely, like, when that was happening, I didn't mention. I was just, like, having her sell single apples, but also mentioning, you know, she really needs money and stuff so that Hector would feel inclined to buy the whole basket to impress her. Yeah, so it's pr pretty much his fault for getting the baby. Yes, yes. His baby. Technically, technically, she didn't offer you guys the basket. <laughs> that's true. And that's that's how that's how you know you gotta get you sometimes. Because I know if I said here have a basket of apples, you guys would have been like, I don't know if you want a basket. We'll just take an apple, maybe. This, you seem sus. <laughs> no, seems sus. No, knowing knowing our group, we would have taken it and been like, yeah. Basket full of apples is better I, than one. I mean, you guys were a little suspicious. You guys were like calling for inside checks on this lady. <laughs> you yeah, just didn't, you just didn't succeed. <laughs> well, what was even funnier is we were all like by the cart, like, "Come on, Hector!" Like, yeah, I know. Come I on. Mean, He's just like, I mean, no, no. <laughs> I mean, literally I two this. seconds before the encounter happened, you heard me giggling to myself. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Seems Jerry has I been don't... taking good care of the premises. He always been the best gardener. He we have. He's always been the best gardener we ever had with us. Mom has not been home much either since father died. Shit, I'm much more emotional than I thought I could be. <sighs> I love this house so much. As much as I hated it, probably. Mm. Look, I don't think I can go in there. Even with you. It's just... Mm -hmm. No. No, I can't. Go without me. I'll wait for you here. Here's the key. Mm -hmm. Oh, and... Wham? If you stumble upon my old music box, would you bring it to me? Thanks a lot. Mm -hmm. Grandma, this house has always been a real labyrinth. Mm -hmm. If you're lost, you have to follow the light. Good luck in there. Mm -hmm. I'll wait for you outside. Sorry, what were you saying? I just wanted to get through the dialogue. <laughs> oh, no, you're good. Uh, during our special with uh, Mopham, um, I tried to record it because I was just like, oh, it'd be fun to, like, I have no idea where I am right now. <laughs> right, you, you um, go, I'm stuck. I, no, you're, you're, you're also very short. Oh, there you yeah, are. Yeah, okay. There and I hit nerfed. record, but I didn't hit record. I hit, um, I accidentally hit, uh, just, uh, instant replay. Ah. Uh. <laughs> and I was just like, gosh dang it. Like, I was so mad because I was so excited to, um, like, be like, hey, look, guys, you know, I have it recorded. We can watch Have some it. memories. <laughs> yeah. That was, uh, that was. <laughs> That was a fun time. <laughs> I am not going to be able to get out of here. Welcome, small traveler, to my humble palace. Everything I own is of the finest quality. Everything is also bolted down, so don't get any funny ideas. Wow, so luxurious. <laughs> hmm, we gotta get in there. Stupid. Did you already get in the secret room? No. Oh, Got it. Okay. Oh, okay, good. I can leave. That's an item for ranch. Yay! No, let me out. Oh. I'm trying to get out myself. Freedom! There you go. There you go. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Over here. Get. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, I'm almost there. Wait yeah, you. you did Hi, it! <laughs> Found the box. Could you give it to me? Mm. Thank you. I'll hold on to it. Mm. Oh, you found something else? Wow, I forgot we even had that. It's an old manual for a Golden Royale. Mm. Remember they had one as a first prize in this town's early yearly tombola? I dreamt of having this machine since second grade, but father would never let me participate in the lottery. Delight, uh, wet. Kurt, are you okay? Kurt, what are you doing? Running into the wall because I can. This manual will come in handy. Valkyra learned that turkeys lay eggs. What? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> mm -hmm. We can use it as an upgrade for our lips. Sorry, my braid is short-circuited there for a second. You're gonna have to elaborate a little bit more. Uh-huh, I mean, you just want elaboration. <laughs> yeah. How, what? Mm -hmm. Did you just like, never consider the fact that turkeys lay eggs? Or is this, yeah. like, just, like, new knowledge completely? We do love Gwen. We do love Gwen here, Halo. Gwen, yeah, let's get back to the boat. And let's not think about turkeys anymore. And forget this place ever existed. Did you? Oh, made her sad you, to come here. Just didn't know that they laid eggs. I mean, I'm curious. Did you think that they gave birth, like, live birth? Like, I'm curious what you thought the alternative was. I'm trying to imagine. 
I thought that turkeys were male chickens. Oh. 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 Okay. I see. Okay. I. You know what? I can understand that. Oh. Hey, an old painting. Don't blame me. Blame Christian public schools. Okay, fair enough. I will blame them. Fair enough. I will blame them indeed. <laughs> hey, Stella. Stella, or wham, I... No, never mind. Nostalgia is not my forte. I'm slightly happy the villa is still in good condition. Or is it? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's change the subject. You must have now the improved tab on your blueprint table. Through there, you can add decorative elements to the spirit houses and stations. Mm -hmm. It's time to upgrade this loom of yours. Once you've got the required resources, go for it. It's the only way to craft fabric from thread. Mm -hmm. Go on. Halo says that what Halo learned this week was how the cockpit of a Boeing 737-800 works. I got to sit inside when coming back from Texas. Oh, that's fun. That's cool. Your teachers told you they were male chickens? Bro, your teachers, really. I wonder if your teachers actually believe that. It, that's entirely possible that they also thought the same thing. I, I, I think I see this a lot in like, um, in boomers, I'm gonna say, <laughs> that I don't think there was a lot of emphasis in like uh, education on nature when they were growing up. Because, you know, when we go, we went, when we were growing up in schools, there was like zoo books, there was National Geographic, there was, um, there was Animal Planet. Even though Animal Planet's not the same anymore, but there, it used to be really cool. Dude, I used to love Animal Planet. Now I, I can't know. stand it because there's I no know. animals in Animal Planet I know. anymore. It it's so stupid. I, I can't believe they freaking did that to Animal Planet, but I also can. Anyway, so I think that there is a lot of just like. Upgraded. Nice. I feel like they just don't know a lot of things that seems like common knowledge to us, to most of us. And you can, like, nowadays, I imagine, <laughs> without Animal Planet being emphasized, <laughs> like, you only have you know, adults to learn from, and a lot of these adults just don't care, or just don't care to learn, or just have no idea. I, I see a lot of stories about, like, kids going to the zoo. And they're like, their teacher is like talking to them about bats and they're like, yeah, bats are like the weirdest birds or whatever. Just saying things that are completely false. But I feel like it's a, it's an endemic thing at this point. Wait, what is a male chicken? A male chicken is a rooster. At least that's, yeah. that's a, yeah, that's a, a rooster. You know, like cockadoodle doo. And turkeys, -doo -doo. turkeys are um, birds with the big fan tails. Yeah, completely well, different. Bird. Okay, let me let me rephrase. And they are the they are the plain looking birds with the fan tails, not the peacock ones. <laughs> Peacocks are normally depicted as very bright blue and green, whereas turkeys are mostly brown colors, and they're very small and fat compared to peacocks. Heck yeah, upgrade that kitchen. Upgrade. Also, it's time for a break, I just realized. Oh, okay. We're gonna take a little break because I also need to get it. I wanna get a snack. No, we're not! We're gonna upgrade more. <laughs> Kurt's gonna upgrade, I'm gonna get a snack. <laughs> upgrade! Oh my god, we're getting so many upgrades, dang. Okay, well, we can't upgrade that anymore. Wrong. Yeah, Valkyrie, just Google search turkey, Google search rooster, and you'll start to see the differences between them. Turkeys are what you eat for Thanksgiving. They're bigger. Mm-hmm. Okay, I think we've upgraded everything. All right, we'll, we can go and break now. All right, then see you guys in just a few seconds. We'll be right back. Not seconds, minutes. We'll be right back. <laughs> 